Boy, it was a hot debate over at the state capitol today as lawmakers hear House Bill 2696. Yeah, this was actually a Democrat-backed bill that was pushing to repeal a law requiring doctors to provide medical care for any babies showing signs of life during an abortion. Let's go right out to Dennis Welch, who is joining us from the newsroom. And Dennis, this isn't going anywhere now, right? Now, as expected, this bill was soundly defeated. But here's the interesting part. More than a dozen Democrats signed up in support of this abortion bill, including Democratic leaders. Now, some of them Democrats are now telling me that they didn't realize what this piece of legislation actually did until it was too late. I am asking that this bill get held. Democratic Representative Raquel Turan pleaded with Republicans to hold off on debating her bill. I'm here to ask respectfully that the committee hold the bill. When her request was denied, Turan ripped into Republicans, accusing them of exploiting a mistake she made to score political points. I actually spoke to a member of this committee. The member of the committee said to me, that today was going to be a circus and they intended to be part of the circus. House Bill 2696 repeals a decades old law requiring doctors make every attempt to save the life of a baby born alive during an abortion. Tehran said she intended to only repeal a 2017 expansion of that older law. And I think this bill is wrong. The proposal turned out hundreds of anti-abortion activists. They packed the committee room and filled the hallways of the Capitol. And explaining why he decided to debate the bill despite requests to hold it, Chairman John Allen said this. This bill was put in for purposes that I objected to, and I've, I've used it to demonstrate our different worldviews. And so with that, I vote no. This bill, again, soundly defeated 8-0 with two Democrats voting present in protest of Chairman Allen's decision to move forward on this bill despite the request to hold it. In the newsroom, Dennis Welch for Arizona's Family.